Mark II TVR Chimera, 4 litre V8, electric blue with Le Mans style twin stripes, private number plates not included, it's had um, upgraded LED lights fitted, it's been painted at some point during its life, it's got good wheels and tyres, alloys are unmarked. Back window's been replaced at some point during its life. The roof trim is in relatively good order. Uh, the battery has been moved to the boot. It's also got an Anderson connector underneath for uh, jump start if required. All the boot carpet and everything's all good. Uh, cream. Leather interior, uh, driver's seat, it's got some light cracking in it but no rips or tears. Oh, actually no, there's a small uh, bit of chunk of uh, leather off there. It's got a uh, black dash with um, aluminium bezel dials, cream. Blue top of the dash, carbon fibre roof. Carpets are in okay condition, a bit mucky. The uh, engine bay, silicone hoses all round. It came in with a fuel pipe fire. It damaged the um, power steering pot and the grill on the top there. We've replaced the pipes and the, the uh, pot. No, anything else it needed replacing. It's now up and running. Uh, can be sold with 12 months MOT if required. TVR heat shield on it there, it's got 11 oil filler cap. Yeah, it's a nice thing. Entry level money. I don't think you could get into one of this sort of money. The outriggers have been done on it, so it doesn't need anything major doing on it. I'll do one of the chassis suspension and start it up next. Go. Chimera chassis and suspension video. The main rails on the chassis are all in good order. Good thick coating of wax oil on them. It doesn't look very pretty, but it serves a purpose. Uh, outriggers and plates are in good order. The outriggers have been replaced. Centre section of the chassis has no issues at all. The gearbox is nice and dry. Haven't got any oil on it. Uh, front outriggers. It's an interesting plate that's been put on there. And outriggers are good. Main chassis section. All good. Bottom of the engine is dry. All of the arms have got a thick coating of uh, wax oil on them. It doesn't dry that stuff, it stays like a wet oil so water doesn't get in between the surfaces. Outrigger tops, good condition, it's had outriggers on it. Um, everything looks okay. <coughs> See how new those outriggers are. No signs of rot or corrosion, so they've clearly been done at some point. 